Trey asks, if you want to use events, do you need to pay for webinar sessions and events all at the same time? Awesome Can you talk question. about the pricing awesome a little question. bit? No, Trey, because it would be redundant. If you have a webinar license, you could upgrade to sessions. And really, so the only difference between events and sessions, sessions is for single session events like mm -hmm. a webinar, just elevating the experience, right? Events is multi-session. That's so that, that's the only difference between those two licenses. You would that whole portal, that whole setup I walk you through today. If you have the sessions license, that's what I would I would uh, recommend. So you could upgrade your your sessions license. But what I didn't show is if you do have a Zoom events license, you could actually unlock some of the premium features in the regular web portal. Um, such as simulated live, our backstage green room, which I didn't even touch on. But you'll see, because I have the license, now I can do simulated live. When I set up, I can use the backstage. Backstage can, is great. It's my. It's really like, oh, honestly, my favorite part of this entire yeah, experience. Yeah. I can yeah. do this session branding. So it, even your webinars would get upgraded because you mm -hmm. get these features enabled in the regular Zoom US portal as well. Great question. Yeah. 